Good morning and happy Monday. So today we're um, going to lunch and we have an extra person. <gasps> to be disattached from wires or unhooked from wires for small amounts of time and they're letting us take Stella to lunch. <laughs> Look, she's so happy riding in her little wagon. This is great news and we got even more great news. Hopefully we can be discharged Thursday. Um, she can go up on eating and go up on dialysis and I got to unhook her from her dialysis this morning. So this is just great news altogether. Does it have to be on the upper side or lower? Um, let's see. Lower side. Hi, sugar. Okay. Ready? Play with the music. Ooh. There we go. I hate this song. Oh, that was good. Hey, Miss Princess, why are you getting upsetting? We're still here. Oh, yeah. Hi, Dan. Hi, Dan. Hi, Dan. Hi, Dan. Medium. Very good. Fair, medium. Fair, poor. So, excellent, fair. very good, good, fair, poor. Good. We get to go home today. Um, I haven't really updated in a while, just because we, like, we've been doing the same thing. Class, sleep, eat, repeat, class, eat, sleep, repeat. And so, I haven't really updated you guys, but we've just been hanging out, me and Robert. Robert, he's taking an online survey, survey. of the hospital. 
tell us how we did. Um, yeah, we're just waiting to get discharged. We're so excited. They're still up there. She had the time of her life during rounds, let me tell you. She was talking above all the doctors. Guess who broke out of the hospital? Stella. Stella, did you break out of the hospital? Did you break out of the hospital? You did, I see your smile. Say, jailbreak, jailbreak. We're just waiting for my mom to bring the car and then we are waiting for Robert with her meds. Um, hi guys, it is Friday, um, it's like 12.30, we, it's, it's our first time home, like super home from the hospital, so we all kind of just slept in, um, even Stella, um, but we did our first full disconnect at home, disconnecting her from the PD catheter at home, huh, we did from dialysis, and it went really well. Um, there's surprisingly a lot of steps that go into it and you have to be like super hand sanitized and super really can't, everything has to be sterile. So it's a, it's a process, but we did it at home for the first time today and it went really well. Um, right now I'm just priming her bag to start her on one of her first feeds of the day because she doesn't really interested in eating. She's not in the best mood, so I'm going to go take care of that. Feels really good to drive again after not being able to really drive for a whole week and a half. It's nice to be behind the steering wheel again. Um, right now, I am just going in to Bellingham. Um, going to, well, I was planning to go to Hoagland's Pharmacy and go to, um, Target because I need Target or Walmart or some something like that because I need to get some storage more storage space to organize all of Stella's medical stuff now um so I was gonna go do that but I got got a call from one of my very very close friends Courtney um who is actually like 36 37 weeks pregnant now and she's in Target and she thinks she might be having contractions so I don't know where my day is going to take me from here, but <laughs> I mean, we might be welcoming a new little chicken nugget into the world, <laughs> but I'll keep you guys, or try to keep you guys posted or updated. Bye. Okay, so. I just met Courtney. Everything is okay for now. Um, she is going home and relaxing and resting and packing some bags just in case, but she's just going to wait it out. I think she'll be okay. Um, but since she's so close, it could really be any time now that she goes into labor. <clears throat> so we'll see. I also picked up some, hopefully some things to store all the stills new medical stuff. Um, I picked up a new water bottle for myself so I can get Kiwi back hers, and I picked up some foundation. Always have to get some makeup, right? Um, now I'm going to Hoagland's Pharmacy to pick up her medication before it closes, and then I think I'm going to run into Fred Meyers because I need to get some um, paint swatches so I can do that thing I talked about um, in a previous video. Um, yeah, so I can finish decorations for Stella's party, which is in two days. Oh man, some man's talking on his phone. Really crazy looking. Do I look that crazy when I'm sitting all by myself talking into this camera? Probably. Solid. Good morning, everyone. Um, I'm looking rough today. Um, it is sad. 
Saturday morning? Saturday. Um, she's taking Stella out to her morning feed because she didn't seem interested enough to eat, which is normal. Um, I'm waiting for Rob to get off of the computer so we can unhook her from the big um, dialysis machine and we can get her started. And then today I have a baby shower I'm going to. Um, not for Courtney, for Jessica. Two different people. Um, but other than that, Courtney was okay yesterday. They were just going to wait it out. Oh, I think I already said that. Oh. So, we're going to this baby shower today. And I was going to swing by the Allison house because they haven't seen Stella since we got out of the hospital. Or since before we got out of the hospital. No, before we went into the hospital. They haven't seen Stella in a little while. So, I'm going to go visit there and make it. Hopefully have time to make some cupcakes and a cake for tomorrow because tomorrow is Stella's actual like birthday par party. I can't open this. Rob? Yeah. I can't open this. Can't open what? Her attachment. What? Her attachment. Mm. Which one? Um, her G-Tube one. Okay. It's stuck. All the goop. But other than that, I think... Whew. That's really it. I know I have to get some things got a little more parents house and set up for the party. Gotta get the high chair over there. And gotta get all the decorations. Um it's not much. I know people kind of um, like why do you throw a party for your one year old? They're not gonna remember it. Um but it's like it's not really for her, it's for me. And I mean it's for everybody else who wants to come and see her who doesn't always get a chance to. But it's really for me. This has been a really hard year for me, and I don't know. I just, I just want to celebrate this lovely lump of Stella. Oh, I can you stand? Ha! <laughs> the seeds look so amazing. The seeds look so amazing. Hug, little girl. Hug. Um, it's quite a bit later. Um, I went over and just hung out at Robert's parents' house. It was good to catch up with them again. Um, we decided to wait and make cupcakes until the morning, which works for me, so they're yummy. Um, but I think right now what I'm gonna do is turn on some music and fold all the clothes that my sister and mom washed for us while we were in the hospital. Um, but little miss is sleeping in bed. And she doesn't feel too good, I don't think. I don't know, it's kind of sad. But she's just gonna sleep while I fold some clothes. Oh, that was a beautiful day. Okay, so today is Stella's birthday party, and it is sunshine theme like we've talked about. But I'm just wearing this yellow shirt from Old Navy. The same jeans as yesterday. Don't tell anyone. And some shoes that I found at um, Value Village. And Miss Stella will have her party outfit on soon, but I'm going to go over and finish cupcakes, and then go over to my house and finish decorating. So it's now the aftermath of Stella's birthday. It is like 4.40, almost 5-ish. And I didn't film during the party just because, like I always say, um, I never know who's really comfortable with that. Um, but Miss Stella is happy. Everyone did really good with their gifts, whether it be like clothes that we need because we need to size up, 
or it be like toys that light up and make noise and feel funny um because that's also what stella loves um so we're very thankful very happy yeah uh, and um my aunt martha is supposed to send me a video of stella doing her smash cake which was so exciting it was so cute i almost started crying when we were singing her happy birthday but i'm emotional so it's fine yeah yeah now we just gotta get I packed all our stuff up into two days, and we just got to get it across the street. And my sister Katie is here to help me with that. Maybe the bath, the bath. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Stella. Happy Okay, so we're a little bit off path. I was supposed to go to my friend Courtney's house and do dinner, but after the party and after we, after being in the hospital all week, we just crashed. So we came home and got all the stuff put in the house, not put away, in, but just in the house, and we just both passed out on the bed, and she's still let out. Um, so I think that's going to be pretty much it for this week. Um, that's... Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry if these videos aren't very entertaining. Right now they're mostly just for me to look back on. Um, and I know they're long, and I know they're tedious, te tedious? I don't know. But they're, it, it, it's fun for me, and it keep, gives me something to do throughout the day. Um, so I really like them. Yeah, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, we'll see you guys next time. Bye.